It's dawn, first day of November at Fort Robinson State Park in northwest Nebraska. Park staff and volunteers from local ranches jump in the saddle or seat of horses, pickups, and ATVs. The annual roundup of Park Buffalo is set to begin. Park Superintendent Mike Moreba recalls the history of bison at Fort Robinson. Back in the early 70s is when they got a few from the National Bison Range in Montana, but since then we've built the herd up for two reasons. One is to keep it so the public can see the buffalo when they're here in the summer, spring and fall. And also are, they're pretty, our herd is genetically pure and it's a pretty popular herd in the buffalo industry. We're trying to keep our herd around 150 breeding cows right now. We auction off nine, between 90 and 100 head a year on average. We supply meat to all the parks and their cookouts, but probably about 25 head yearly. Buffalo aren't like working cattle, we have to be ahead of them at certain points, so we use the vehicles, pickups, as well as ATVs along with horses. They're just a lot faster, quicker animal, and if we can be in the right spots at the right times, it's better that way on them and us. On a different morning, some of the Longhorn cattle are rounded up. Then a few weeks later, both the surplus Longhorns and bison are auctioned off to public interest at the Crawford, Nebraska sale barn. Sold to you at $350.